Assalamualaikum. I'm back from all my trips and uh, I didn't do a lot of vlogging. Uh, I tried, but I kept forgetting. <laughs> but it was a pretty good trip to the wedding. Um, and then I came back and a friend was visiting from out of town. So we went to dinner, took the baby to dinner with us on South Beach. And that was pretty good, but um, I was pretty tired. So today I didn't do anything. And I ordered dinner. Look at this. Mm -mm. Pizza Florentine. I know I don't ate half of it. It's a shame. I ordered a Greek salad. And I don't know what they gave me. This is like a regular salad. So I just put ranch on it. But whatever. But the pizza's pretty good with spinach and feta and mozzarella. Um, <clears throat> so that was nice. And um, I did my hijab like uh, it is from Nabila B. Cute little easy drape style. I didn't do it quite as cute as her, but... It's good for when my hair is too big to put in a ponytail. Anyway, I just wanted to say hi. Um, I wasn't planning to go to Iftar's while at the masjid while um, my husband's at Umrah because I didn't want to be traveling alone with the baby. But I might actually because I don't want to cook and I don't want to order food every night. But tonight I just couldn't do anything. So that's it. Iftar alone. I actually haven't been fasting because uh, I've been really worn out. Excuse me. I need to probably start taking the prenatals again since I stopped. But um, I've been really thirsty and hungry and tired and dizzy and all of that um, during the day at different times. So I was like, let me just take it easy. But I'm still making plenty of milk. So... Um, I just have to make up the days later, inshallah. It's been a really good Ramadan, though, but I don't feel like I've been accomplishing as much as I wanted to. Um, of course, with a baby, it's kind of hard to do certain things, but I'm trying to remind myself that all my daily activities can be worship. So I'm trying to remind myself of that when I'm sweeping the floor, um, you know, washing the dishes, changing the baby, all of this. If I have uh, taqwa, could be worship, you know. So alhamdulillah, because I feel like I'm not getting enough time to read and, and do extra prayers and, you know, whatever. So I started playing Quran when I was, like, sweeping the floor. Let me drink some water. I'm so thirsty. <laughs> Which means that the baby's probably about to wake up. Um, Isn't that weird when you're breastfeeding how your body knows when your baby's about to wake up? Like, I'll get thirsty and I'll feel the milk start to come down and then she'll make a little noise. But people tell me that happens even when, like, you're not at home. Like, you're at the store or something, and your baby will, like, be crying at home, and you'll the milk will start coming. And then someone will call you, like, your baby's crying now. And you're like, oh, wow. So connected, subhanAllah. So, I don't know if you guys saw Sister Nye's, um video. Her and Sister Rebecca did the video about Adopt a Revert. Isn't that sweet? MashaAllah. Um... I hope a bunch of people do it um, who saw it, but I thought that was a really great idea. And I was thinking about, since he's not here for Eid, I'm going to go to the Eid prayer. And uh, I'm sure some people invite me over, but if not, I'm about to ask somebody, can I come over? <laughs> Tacky, I know, but I don't want to, I'm not going to sit at home alone for Eid, me and the baby. So I've got friends who I think will probably invite me. So inshallah, it'll um, be all good. So, um... Wafiq made it to Umrah, and he said the harem is beautiful, and the room is really nice. You can see the Kaaba from the room, subhanAllah. And um, he said it's a lot of people there, and they told him that the last five days, it's like more people even than like um, during Hajj. So I'm like, wow, people from all over the world. So he said it's really nice. He's having a good time. And... Um, you know, I don't know. That's it. Make dua for us. And I'll make dua for you. I hope you're all having a great Ramadan. Um, I think I am. I, I just, I expect it to do more. But I just have to, you know, accept the fact that it is what it is. And, you know, I'm taking care of my baby. And that is blessed. And, um, and when I wake up in the middle of the night, I just try to make myself get up and do Kiyam. Um, and that's it. Peace and blessings. Masalama.